Have you ever wondered how hard it truly is to shoot a mile long shot? For me, I've wondered this for a while. And today, thankfully, I'm out here at the Paul Nelson farm who has a really long range and it goes up to a mile. But we're gonna be shooting a 6.5 Creedmoor bullet. But this thing, let me tell you, is about the size of your pinky. So it's really not that big of a load. Most people wouldn't shoot this at a mile long target. All right guys, this is Paul Nelson's professional long range shooter, Josh, the instructor out here. Josh, can you tell us what happens to a bullet of a 6.5 Creedmoor at a mile? Yeah, absolutely. So obviously we do have a mile target set up here. We've got cameras linked to it so we can see exactly where he hit. 6.5 Creedmoor is obviously not an ideal cartridge to shoot a mile, but we go ahead and teach some ballistics in there and get everybody out here to be able to shoot the mile target. That bullet's gonna drop about 140, 150 feet at a mile. So obviously we've gotta make that correction. Lots of time we're gonna run out of the adjustment of the scope itself. So we're gonna actually hold dial up all the way on the, the elevation turret and then hold some in the reticle as well. In addition, to that we obviously have the wind coming into play like earlier today we were hitting with about eight mils of wind so when we're dialing elevation dialing the turret running out of elevation in the turret and holding it in addition to holding wind makes it challenging but we get it done boom shakalaka Screen's really, really bad. But right there at the top of the yellow is the hit from a mile away with the 6.5 creep. Mode. 